Life's supposed to be a daring adventure, is it not? I can't understand people anymore. I just can't understand it. The modern era, the level of conformity, cowardice, endless mental enslavement is absurd. It's obscene. It's unprecedented in all of history. I haven't met a single person in my entire life that wants to go on a grand adventure every day. That want to, that, but believe in it enough to, to act. I mean, we all want to have this grandiose life of adventure and travel and ooh, culture and kumbaya. I don't have friends. <laughs> you know I me. Mean? You know how many people in my generation, a, aren't in college, <laughs> and if they're not in college, they're either attached to a, a job they can't leave, parents or some kind of place or establishment, friends or a girlfriend they think they love, and then, ah, uh, or if they don't have that shit and they are like vagabonding. Then they're just like completely, they're either destitute or they don't have any drive to like, the, the, the rigidity of our thought pattern is stupid. Yo, why don't, why don't you leave college? Why don't you leave that life that you're so unsatisfied with? That life that you wanna change and evolve from, right? Why don't people leave it? Why don't they leave? My friends, changing your environment is the most radical way to revolutionize your life. It's that simple. Your environment affects your DNA more than anything. <laughs> Why don't you leave? Ah, oh, because I, I just can't leave this person. I love them so much. Or like, I have all this attachment and I have this, this great business network. Or, you know, I have friends and family here. It's like, yo, 90% of people in this world are miserable. The rest are unsatisfied deep down. There's, there's, how many people do you really know that are like, yeah, <laughs> like actualized? They're out here killing it. They're full self, having fun, creating epicness. <laughs> it, it, it's, it's constant distraction and compensation and energy enslavement. That's what's going on out here. That's the dead truth. They give their energy away to the system so that they can, you know, throw some more money on the pile behind them, go grab the house, the mortgage, you know, gonna get tied to all, this, all these death bonds. Oh, I gotta I got start saving money for when I'm 40. Oh, I gotta save money just in case, you know, the car breaks down or I need to go to the hospital or whatnot. And like, this message isn't, quite for everyone like like if you have kids and a family and like you're already like deep and committed to many things like yo, you, you got a different path that you need to tread but like I'm speaking to everyone out here that isn't completely chained to something everyone who's in the age of 20 to 30 we got a lot of nomads watching this channel most likely share this video <laughs> My friends, there needs to be a different ideal, a different perception of like what's possible out here. The moment that you tell someone that like, oh no, you, you, you don't have like a great job or anything. No, you're not, you're not, actually don't even have a job right now. Oh, what do you do? You know, I like to, I like to climb mountains. That's what I do. And climb trees. Like they, they, they just instantly put you in this label of, oh, He's a bum. Oh, he's he's destitute, right? Or like, it's like, yo, you're clutching all this bullshit that doesn't make you happy, this meager pleasure, because you think? No, it's because you fear. Grasping a life worth living. <laughs> Just, it's, you're resigning to bullshit. <laughs> The greatness within you, that great book, the masterpiece of art, the Mozart that lives within, he ain't gonna come out 
if you're spending all your energy holding on to, to dying shit, <laughs> free yourself. My friends, I, I'm so committed to living an aesthetic ide like, I ideal. <laughs> I'm so committed to it right now. And like, I've been, I've been trying for a long time, but like now I know it's the only way. My friends, live with only what you need. Hold on to very little and less than that. Be able to move freely, right? My friends, with the advent of the internet, right? I, I just think about this. I don't know a single person who's pursuing online business in real life. I don't know a single person. The online world is the fastest growing market and the largest market in the entire world. Yet I don't know a single person. Everyone my age <laughs> should like, lit it's like, yo, you know, you, you could spend like a couple months figuring ways out, right? It, it's like, there's no drive. There's no, my friends, this life could be a wonderful adventure every day, <laughs> every day. Yet you just want to hold on to the bullshit. You want to clutch the old life, the old system, and this unsatisfactory existence in which you live. And you're going to clutch that till the day you die. Because you're scared. You're, you're scared. <sighs> because you've been indoctrinated into a society of complete conformity. Of, of, of energetic slavery. You're scared of being a real human being out here. I can't wait until I meet, meet real human beings out here. It's not just a matter of being free and being, you know, all kumbaya and I'm, I'm a free spirit, you know? Nah. The thing that drives life, the complete beauty and passion of it is the inner beauty a like and the outer beauty because it's the same but but your creation your creativity and expression how powerful that is right how moving it's about yeah it, it, I, I just I just don't understand this world I literally don't understand it why is everyone grasping the bullshit? Come on, come over here. It's, the water's fine, right? Yet, even in like the spiritual, free-spirited community, like I'm hanging out with, like, I don't got any friends because I can't find anybody that shares the same vision as me. <laughs> the PSYOP. Of the, of the hippie, you know what I mean? It's, it's a sigh up, my friends. All these spiritual people out here, they're low energy because they don't got any earth element because they're not a human. <laughs> they're not living. Be alive. Be daring. Be bold. Every day should be a new horizon. Every day. <laughs> like, yet, we're, we're, I don't get it. I just don't get it. I don't understand. More to be said. <laughs>